In today's world, women are all over televisions playing almost every kind of role imaginable. Roles that, once upon a time, wouldn't have been allowed to fly by most network executives. Then these women came along and helped to transition the roles of women into what they are today. They paved the way for the actresses of tomorrow and did a heck of a job while doing so. Get ready for a good ol' estrogen punch. This is Most Influential Women in TV History. 12. Lena Dunham Oh boy. This is a woman that many just love to hate and hate to love. She's known as being extremely outspoken, and she pushes many boundaries that, sometimes, aren't meant to be pushed. She's pretty unafraid and continues on forging her own path, ignoring the haters and those that want to see her fall. But we do have to respect her work ethic and her ability to do and say things that are a little outside of the box. Things that differ from the norm, and she most definitely isn't too shy about opening up about her personal issues. She's used her show, Girls, to explore many controversial topics, including sexuality and gender roles, and while it can get extremely uncomfortable at times, she pushes through and obviously doesn't care what anyone else thinks. She's influential. You've got to admit it. And you've got to accept that she's earned her place right here on this list. Love her or hate her. 11. Katie Sackhoff Here's a gal that helped to break the mold of women having to be ladylike and gentle. Katie Sackhoff seems to play only strong, tough characters, and has shown that it's okay to be a little more on the masculine side. Hey, tomboys are fantastic too, and they should most definitely be represented on this list. She was Kara Starbuck Thrace on Battlestar Galactica and Vic Moretti on Longmire, two characters that definitely challenge the common conceptions of what it means to be a lady. She's given many girls the go-ahead to be themselves, and and that's admirable. 10. Mindy Kaling So you may know Mindy as Kelly from The Office, or maybe as herself in The Mindy Project, but did you know that she was more than just an actress on those two shows? In fact, she was also a writer and a producer on both of them. And that doesn't always happen in the entertainment world, especially with women. She's also written things like popular plays, best-selling books, and beloved blogs. She's really incredible. She's trailblazing a path through the stigmas on what can and can't be done, and she's doing it with style. She's also hilarious and hard working, smart, and unafraid. Thus why she most definitely earned a spot on our list of influential women on television. 9. Kate Mulgrew did you know that back in 1965, when Star Trek was just beginning, its pilot episode was rejected at first because network executives thought it was sort of ridiculous to have a female as the second in command of the ship? Well, we all know that that rejection didn't last long, and the show went on to have a long, long run. And 30 years after the initial rejection because of a female second in command, Kate Mulgrew came along, and in 1995's Star Trek Voyager, captained a starship. Can you imagine what those execs would have thought of something like that back in 1965? 65, it was a big moment for the show and for television in general, thus making Kate Mulgrew or Captain Catherine Janeway quite the influential woman on TV. And now she's red on Orange is the New Black. 8. Gillian Anderson Oh boy, here she is, the one and only Dana Scully. Wait, no, we mean Gillian Anderson, darn it. Executives really wanted a tall, long-legged blonde to play Scully, but the show's creator, Chris Carter, cast the short and curvy Gillian instead, and it turned out to be probably the best decision that could have ever been made for the X-Files. She brought so much to the show and proved that women could be just as smart, cunning, and capable as their male co-workers and peers, and without her, the show probably wouldn't have been nearly as successful as it was. Anderson herself is just as strong as her on-screen character, doing what she wants, when she wants, and doing it all with style. She is cool and beautiful all at the same time, and she's proven that women can conquer all, even when the odds and opinions are stacked against them. 7. Laverne Cox Some of you may not know the name, but if you haven't been missing out on two breakout shows for years, you'll definitely recognize her by sight. This is Laverne Cox, aka Sophia on Orange is the New Black, and Sheena on The Mindy Project. Those are two huge roles that have gained her a lot of exposure, and what differentiates her from every other woman on this list is that she's transgender, and she's proud of it. She was actually the first ever transgender woman to produce her own TV show, Transform Me, and was the first openly transgender woman to be featured on the cover of Time magazine and to be nominated for an Emmy. She advocates for the trans community and has produced various documentaries about the trans community and everything that comes with it. Laverne Cox is inspiring and influential and one heck of an actress. We love you, Sophia. 6. Ellen DeGeneres 
Hey oh, who knows Ellen? Who loves Ellen? Everyone? Good. Ellen DeGeneres has most definitely become a television staple and has made a massive name for herself in the entertainment world. With her genuine, um, genuineness, her wit, her humor, her empathy, her dancing, ah, the list could go on and on. She's won the hearts of not just women, but of the nation as a whole. She's also gay, and her decision to come out to the world in 1997, a time when she was basically on fire in the TV world, and when homosexuality was still pretty taboo, has really elevated her to the level of a cultural icon. She's definitely thrived since then, as we all already know, and went on to have a supremely successful talk show that still plays almost every day and has since 2003. Yeah, we'd say that's pretty darn influential. 5. Lucille Ball if you didn't know that this woman would show up on the list, we just have to ask you, how? Lucille Ball stands out amongst many of the women on television, as she pushed the boundaries and did pretty much everything that she wanted to do, in a time when women were looked down upon for doing so. But she succeeded in everything she did. I Love Lucy was a massively successful show, but she did so much more, and that makes her influential and beloved. She didn't hide her interracial marriage, nor her pregnancy on national television. She championed for women in the workplace, she ran a major production company, and championed such incredible TV shows as Star Trek and Mission Impossible. She was a beast and helped to lay out the footprints that many women would walk in, footprints larger than almost anyone else can ever fill. 4. Nichelle Nichols all right, all right. We all know that this woman was pretty groundbreaking with her appearance on Star Trek, which, just to point out, is a show Lucille Ball championed. But Nichols acting in the show wasn't just a huge step forward for women in television and entertainment, but also for women of color. She was, in the show, shown as an equal to men in the crew, a specialist in her field that was well-respected and trusted just as much as her male co-workers. Not to mention, on American television, she and William Shatner shared one of the first interracial kisses ever. She once even considered leaving the show. Early on, she thought she might want to quit and find something else to work on, but her friend Martin Luther King Jr. convinced her to stay as he knew how important the role was. Crazy. 3. Verity Lambert This woman was given a show, a show that wasn't expected to do all that well, nor was anyone counting on it to last very long. In fact, the little show we're talking about was supposed to be a children's educational program, but in the end, it became much, much more than that. Doctor Who is the program that we speak of, and yes, all of what we just said about it is true. Verity was the first producer of the show and managed to mold it and adapt it into what it is today, a long-running, generation-spanning, iconic piece of of art that has stood the test of time and is looking to do so for some time to come just goes to show that women are powerful and creative and awesome. Verity Lambert was all of those things and more. 2. Mary Tyler Moore What do we even say about this lady? She was influential, she was forward-thinking and working, and she helped to pave the way for many women in the television industry today. She managed to charm and give us some noteworthy moments in The Dick Van Dyke Show as Laura Petrie. But where she really made the difference was with her very own show that even featured her name, The Mary Tyler Moore Show. She played an unmarried woman who was more concerned with making her career successful than she was with finding a husband, which was very different and ambitious for the 70s, and ended up working her way up to a full-fledged producer in a newsroom. The show also delved into topics that, at the time, were still a bit taboo to talk about on television. Homosexuality, discrimination, divorce, sexism, birth control, and equal pay were all featured topics on the TV show, and while they were a bit controversial, it handled them quite well. Her reach has been far and long, and she's even popular enough today to use in songs, as Weezer proves, as they sing about her in the song Buddy Holly. She was an icon and will go down in the history book as an incredibly influential woman on and off television. 1. Oprah Let's all just take a second to recognize the TV goddess that is Oprah Winfrey. When you think of women on television, there's no doubt that Oprah is one of the first that comes to mind. That's because she's a hugely influential TV personality and is a legend in that industry for many different reasons. She had her own talk show for years and years, The Oprah Winfrey Show, where she gained the trust and attention of millions of people from all over the world. Then she was given her own TV network, OWN, and also focuses her time on producing media that helps women in particular and has her own book club that helps to highlight relatively unknown authors. She's filling philanthropic beyond belief and has even dabbled in politics, pushing for the things and people she believes in with her enormous influence. Oprah is indeed the queen of television, and we'd be surprised if we ever see another woman even come close to dethroning her.
Man, these ladies are inspirational. Without them, we'd still be stuck in the Stone Age of TV while watching men play the important roles. And that would be plain old boring, right? Tell us your thoughts down in the comments. Don't forget to hit that like button, and make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on any of the great videos we upload every few days.